people. Hey everybody, it's just a quick one from me and him. And this Elsie. This is the star, yeah, this is our Elsie down here, guys. Our Elsie Moo. Yeah, guys, this is going to be the start of a very long vlog from today, which is Friday, to oh. next Friday, when we're going to take in, what's happening today? Jaden, but Jaden's birthday. That is our Artie's brother. Yeah, so we're going for a meal at Bella Italia and then we are going to bowling. That's tonight. <gasps> Tomorrow, I'm off to Lancaster, which you'll see. We're going to go and take our Barney up there. Elsa here is now partially paralysed. I just dropped the camera. Shut up. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Elsie has had an accident. She's done her back in and now she's partially paralysed. So she can't walk no more, guys. On her back legs, legs have gone. So we're looking after her as best we so can. So they have told us basically um, it could be a seven grand operation, but we're doing everything at the moment we can to just yeah. make her life brilliant. She'll and we'll still have a good life. We'll get her like one of their wheelchair yeah, things. Yeah, the wheels touch the back of the legs. I mean, she'll still have a good life. All dogs that are par partially paralysed can. It's got to keep her going. Uh, feed her and help us to talk. It's a bit of a nuisance, but that's the way it is. You but see what you do, anyway, we will let you know her progress and she will be fine because we love her so much. Yep. And so we're going to take you on our journey. Yep. So we'll be filming tonight. We'll be filming. Lil take the. We're going bowling, we'll show you that. Lil take the camera with him tomorrow. Do right. a little. Bella Italia tonight, we'll show you that. And he'll on your journey tomorrow. Show you Lancaster tomorrow on the train. Just not that. whilst you're on the train with holding the dog. No, obviously not. And then Monday we're off to Wales. We'll show you all that for a week. Or five so days. stay tuned and watch till the end of this video. It might be a long one, but we're going to have some fun and we're going to take you on the journey An with emotional us. Emotional journey. I mean, Christ. It's been a heck of a bloody few days. It's crazy. We'll tell you all about it when we get a bit more time, guys. Yep. Keep watching. How are we all doing, guys? So it's me again. It's about ten minutes after we've done the first bit. So this is what's happening, okay, so our RLC, like, let's give you a, a quick rundown. She started like panting crazy a couple of days ago, I was like, what the hell's wrong with her? And then like, she couldn't stand on her back legs. Like, oh my God, so I got to the vets and they've said she might have slipped a disc, which costs like seven grand to get fixed, or you just give them pain medication, hope that it settles down and they get some sort of mobility back. So that's the situation at the minute. So she's coming on holiday with us. It was Barney originally, now it's our RLC. Uh, We've got this crate set up in here because they said keep her in a crate like as much as you can so she don't run around the house or try to. Look what's happened. The crate has a new uh, resident. Yes, that there is our Milo who is way too big for said crate. Look at the size of it compared to him. Right Milo, can say hello? Yeah, he wants to but he's, he can't be asked. Then over here we have and Doris, who's our Elsie's sister, and then Miss Nature of Crazy, and Cheddar, who's best friends with Elsie. Ain't you, Ched? You missing Elsie? Yeah, of course, yeah. Anyway, guys, I'm off skis to feed the dogs because we're going out for dinner tonight. And like I said, tomorrow I'm off to Lancaster, which is like a four hour journey all around. Um, mad few days, guys, trust me. Me and I'm just they're not are destined to not go away without an issue. Anyway. <laughs> You get filming me bowling. Well, I'm not doing it bowling, aren't we doing it out for a meal? Oh, Mum, my hair's it's too short. It's not it's not right. I haven't done it right. Stop him putting your hair to it. Your natural beauty makes up for it, mate. Yeah, yeah, to avoid the camera. She literally had some. Alright, sorry, Mo, you're a pint of bud. Yeah. You know your mask going off your face, it's going on YouTube. What? Your mask is on your face. Oh, as long as I thought you was going to tell me my mic. No. It's you and Queen, the fashion brothers, aren't you? Your mask's yeah. off your ears. Yeah, actually, if Donna's the Of course, Donna's in the cool guy. Yeah. Cool on the guys. I don't want to break the law. Oh. Live it up, Quinn. Huh? Live it up a bit, take a mask off. <laughs> I don't want to get fined. You want? you can have a pint. Well, I don't know the rules. Look at that, guys. Look at her jersey drinking here. Look at that. Big on her. On a cream cow. Oh, my God. I'm in a picture. <laughs> Big chug of our cream cow. Don't worry, I'll take you to my head. You'll have a job, are you? You'll be in Wales. Well, yeah. She was great at the time. 
Come on, Imo. Where the hell? Come on, Imo. Oh, Imo. Get in, love. Oh, I'm actually good on the second time, though. See, you got a film, though. Oh, you put the tap well done. Thank you. I'm out, you're in the lead. Jackie time! time. Oh, you, you got one! You got one, it's alright. <laughs> oh, what a shame. <laughs> Hi everyone and welcome back to me and Lee's Morning Lee's Vlog Vlog a week one week whole vlog Yeah this is our holiday vlog a beginning weekend so today Very mouthful. Today is Friday Today we have started our holiday mode We have been out for a wonderful meal with Quinta and Donna and their son Jaden um, and obviously Tia for their celebration double birthday thing also, it's we're Jay, back. It's Jane's 10th, T is 18th, we've been about four days with each other, the brother and sister, so we did a double double day. Plus, we can't do so all in the house. We went to have a big party for her and invited some people up and around the country to the party. Fell through because of COVID. So, we went the best of a bad situation. We went bowling. I got my ass whooped, well and true. I got beat by a 10 year old and by Aim and by everyone else. I come last. Yeah, but at the end of the day, it's the taking part that counts. Isn't yeah, it? tell yourself that when you're not last time. It's easy to say when you don't finish last. Trust me. Yeah. So it's having a drink or two now, guys, and then I'm up early tomorrow on a journey to north of the border. He'll be taking you guys with him. Ooh, exciting time. So he'll be showing you a little bit where he's going, what he's doing. Yeah, vlogging. Me and Barney. Taking me. My my co-star Barney. Where he? Always taking me, and he's leaving me behind. Literally, it's a two hour stop over. I'll be well, there not. and back. He'll be there at 12, he won't be back till 5. So, I'm going to make use of the time anyway. I'm going to get my rest of my holiday things sorted. Lift it up. I'm going to get the rest of my holiday things sorted and get the house in order. I'll make sure Elsie's okay. Wait for a couple of deliveries. We've got a pet carrier coming for Elsie. Got so much coming tomorrow, delivery one. Uh, my, my mom, something for my mom and whatever else. I'm going to get tears, things together. And also, just general finishing yeah. packing, really. Literally tomorrow, guys, we've got rubber rings coming for Tia to have a laugh in the pool. Rubber balls coming for Tia in the pool. We've got syringes for Elsie so we can feed her because she stops eating. But basically, good news, she's walking a little bit better again, guys. If you didn't know, the other day, just a quick rundown, Elsie went to the vets, they told her she had a really bad slip disc. She could be paralysed, it could end up being putting her to sleep. £7,000 worth of operations, but touch wood, she is going to be hopefully okay and go have the best life she can. Living her best life. Yeah. Like this lady at the bowling alley tonight that had a top on that didn't cover her belly. And you really should have done. And Creek kept saying, it's alright, she's living her best life, I don't worry about it. And it was not a pretty sight. But anyway, it doesn't really make no difference, Adam. <laughs> Come in a bit closer. She's sure had a COVID mask on it. Um, but either way, mm. we are. Gonna we're going to take you on our whole adventure, on our whole holiday, and it started tonight. So you will now be with us and every single day we're going to vlog. Days. We're going to do cooking videos. We, we might not do a mukbang necessarily. We're going to do cooking videos, shopping videos at Morrison's. We're going to do some out and about with Iman Lee. Two Morrison's probably, that's it. I've got to do an arm replacement in a minute. And we're going to have generally a fab time we'll show you a tour around the cottage yes we will guys and a little bit of train ladies. journey yeah zilot so a... holiday mode has begun swimming pool time hot tub days so, hey times really in the sun so when we see you next this will be tomorrow when lee is vlogging his way up to sunny lancaster i am so sunny and then 
we'll be tomorrow night on our live. Yes, guys. I've got to go, yeah. guys. My arm's going to fall off here. Thanks, guys. How are we doing, guys? We are at the train station. Me and Barney. We're on a trip, bar. Where are we going? Where are we going? Yeah. Going to Lancaster. Sunny Lancaster. Can't be any worse than here. It's dead dull here. Good. It's cloudy. It's been a bit wet. Didn't wake up till half eight. It's meant to be half six. So it's a mad rush today. I had to catch a train at half ten. So let's get up at half eight. Get ready, have a coffee, have breakfast. I had breakfast, met some food. Get to the shop, sort Barney out, sort the other dogs out, sort Elsie out with a toilet and a tablet and all the other stuff. Drama. Trust me, EastEnders don't have this much drama anyway. So we're going to catch up with the big guys around the train. Barney, say goodbye. Barney, Barney, say goodbye. Some farm animals. Okay, I got council. That's cool. Oh, bloody hell. I'm drinking. Wigan Northwestern, Preston, Lancaster, Oxen Home Lake District, Carlisle, Haymarket. Okay guys, so we've been in Lancaster in about two minutes. This is the sort of area I come from. Lots of fields. Literally England's filled with fields. When you're on a train you get to see a shitload of it. Look at that. It's going on You okay? You happy to be going? Probably not. We've got some sheep, how exciting, and another field, well hey, more sheep, and another field, what a barn, bloody hell. Okay, so we finally made it to Morecambe, me and my little bar now, going for a little walkie walkies, walkie poos, it's absolutely pissing now, what do you expect though in October in uh, Lancashire? We've got Jerry's fishing over there. Well, hey, I love a bit of Jerry. Not that I ever go fishing, obviously. Some sort of monument thing here to, I don't know, wood and metal. Don't really know what it's meant to commemorate. And over here we have the sea. Let's go and take a look, see at the sea, sea, seaside. Yeah, our sea's not as blue as other people's, unfortunately. We get the crappy end of the sea around here. I thought the tide's coming in. Quick, get your life jackets, the tide's coming in. Or going out, I don't bloody know what the difference is. Other than one of them you drown in, one you don't. Oh, bon. So here we are, guys, at the sea. There's been to a beach somewhere. It's covered up by the sea at the minute down there. So I'm going to get back because it's peeing down and getting soaked. I want a coffee and a bicky. It's easy to be. So we're heading back now. Look at the state of my hair. I've just had a put up by the way, guys. And I didn't bring a hat. <gasps> Lee's not got his hat on. Hip, 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 hooray. If I did, it would be sunny now because the sun's all shining when I got my hat. Maybe not. There's the scenery, guys. There's our Barney. There's me. See you in a bit. How are we all diddling, guys? We are here at Lancaster Train Station. Look at the state of my hair. It's got worse as the day has gone on. Still look last night's air waxing. Well, hey, 
That's living it large. Living it, living it, living it large. <laughs> yeah, so this is a train station. Very small station, man. About three or four platforms, I believe. Oh, but wait to go home. Back to Amo and T. And we have the dogs and Bryn, the mother in law. Yeah, so Barney is staying with my mum and Bob, as you've seen in the video. Did you see him? Did I record anything of Barney there? I did a bit of my granddad's, you might get to see some of that, but I'll have to edit out the sound because you can't understand the word my granddad says. I can't anyway. <laughs> so there you are. So anyways, we're heading back home to Wolves. We've got a traffic now, what we've got to do. So we're heading back home, we've got to change at Preston. If you don't know Preston, then you're probably not from the UK. And then, go back and do a mukbang. And a live mukbang. I can't even sort this out, guys, just to put up with the flipping state of it. <laughs> uh, yeah, and then it's Monday, back at the train station to go on holiday to Wales. Hope we're all good. You enjoyed this vlog? It's a bit shit. I need to do something exciting, don't we? Should I get on this seat and jump up and down? Should I do that? Would that be exciting? Or make me look like an idiot? How are we doing, guys? So we're here at Preston Station, and there's our train. Well, it was on there. 1617 Platform 5. There you go. Preston looking as gloomy as ever. Trust me, this station I don't think has ever won an award for appealing places to be. Yeah, but if you're not from the UK, this isn't how all stations look. Birmingham station's pretty good. Keep pissing down. Absolutely lashing down, guys. Well, you, can see, you can just like see it there. And there's another train if you're a train spotter. That will be the North Northern Rail Line train going to somewhere up north. Oop, let's not tr let's try and not fall down the steps. Cause it's fucking chewing gum. It's all about fucking tramps. Platform five and three quarters. So our get on train platform, guys. Platform five. I wonder if it's our train. Could be now. Let's find out. So I've got that thing in Games Preston early. Guaranteed getting on our train then. Did that. I've been sat here half an hour. The frigging driver was on a train from Edinburgh to get to here to drive us on. He ain't frigging turned up. He's out having a bloody donut or something. I've not he's got his finger in there in the baker. One of the other. But I'm still sat here. It's now like half. We're in a way like 17 minutes ago. I bet he's not trying now. Are you there, Mr. Driver? Are you there? Are you there? He's somewhere behind the arms. Okay, guys, we're off. We're on our way back. The final leg of our trip. We're I mean, in a trip that's been set about two hours each way. It took us forever. Um, about an hour and 50 minutes is meant to take. But literally, as we were coming out the station, there was a bloke there filming. I was like, yes, it's me. You got it. I'm here. I'm famous. Do you want a picture? Turns out he wasn't filming me. He was filming the train. Classic train spotter. Welcome on board. This is a very like, nice like train, train service to like London Eastern. Train to me. Calling at well, if you Wigan can North off, Western, exist. Warrington it's Bank like Key, Crewe, Wolverhampton, Sandwell and Dudley, Goodbye, Birmingham Star. New Street, Preston Birmingham Monday. International, Coventry, Rugby. Milton Keynes Central, Watford Junction. I don't know if you're seeing this, I'm not trying to edit a lot of this crap out. It's just not interesting. If you see something that doesn't look right, so, speak to staff I wish or text British Transport I've Police this now, 10 on times 61016. We'll sort it. Oh, no. See it, say it, sorted. See it, say it, shut up. I've heard you already. We're still travelling back, guys. It's now half past five. I'm as ordered a Chinese. I am counting down the seconds till I'm home and eating the food for a mukbang. Talk about dedication. <laughs> we're, we're literally like 10 subs away now from 2000. My bidet's looking at right here. The water. Running across the window. It's pretty cool. 
I feel sorry for the cows out in the field this time of day in the rain. I just passed them a minute ago. It's a bit cruel. Anyways, so I'll show you some more field gents enough of them already have you. I'd love to own a field. How cool would it be to have your own field? You could do anything you want in there. You could put sheep, cows, dinosaurs, dinosaur sheep. Wow, look at the water, what's it doing? What the hell? Look at that. That's so odd. <laughs> Anyways, so these are the bit. Oh, some uh, weed cannabis tents. Got some sheep. Some little baby sheep. I don't know. And lots of trees. If you like trees, England is the place to come. Boom, oh, New Zealand. How are we doing, people? It's Sunday. Yeah. We've popped to town to buy a new phone because somebody broke my phone. And also to go and get Mo's baby thing. Yeah, some of you, well, a lot of you won't actually know who Mo is, but totally honest, in the comments on our videos, he's a good friend of ours and he has a baby called Baby Lee, named after me. Hello, guys. Hello. We're alright, mate, thank you. No. <laughs> Not no. today, mate. <laughs> we don't want gas and electric, we've got enough as it is. Um, they're pesty everywhere, aren't they? If it's not Jehovah's, it's people selling you gas like trees. Don't stop with anything. So yeah, we've got time, guys, to pick up some stuff before we go away tomorrow. Yes, social distance. It's freezing. It ain't hard social distance up here, though, guys, because the town's sodden empty. It's like a scene at a walking dead. Yeah, but that's why you better come in on a Sunday, aren't you? No, Sunday's fun day. We should be watching football right now. Anyways, catch you in a bit. We are having a subway, guys. First thing I've had in, like, the last 12 hours. Oh, lovely Emma. Look at that. Not a, not a foot long, just a six inch today, guys. So, Emma, you okay? Yeah. In fun? Yes, Christ. <laughs> we haven't done much yet, guys. <laughs> it's amazing, our town centre. See you in a bit, guys. How are we doing, guys? So, I'm waiting for Emma while she looks at makeup. Hey. Makeup. Whatever we look at in Superdrug. This bloke, he won't bugger off. He's just been watching over me for ages now. It's ridiculous. How are we doing? Got a new phone. That's so blind. We've been to Iceland. It's like a food shop. Getting stuff for our sandwiches and stuff for tomorrow for our trip to Wales. Let's hear some birthday presents. Which on Friday we bought Mel's baby, baby Lee, some lovely stuff. Our own pigs it was amazing. We had a bump uh, running with an old enemy. Or enemies. Yep. We got a few around here. That's it. Busy, busy, busy guys. I was around somewhere. Oh, I don't know. It's this bloke now. I'm sure he's stalking. <laughs> oh, you're all good. Uh, and enjoying our videos. How are we doing, people? It's Sunday evening. Whoop, whoop. Sunday evening. Whoop, whoop. Wrapping up. Wrapping up. Wrap it, wrap it. Wrapping our tears presents, guys. Where's it, buddy, gone? Oh, here it is. So, we have bought our. So, so tears got everything. Well, literally everything. And shouldn't need much. Really, so here we've bought. We've got some new trainers. We've got a gin you know today, right? So I'll tell you what a cap like a baseball cap, it has to be like a camouflage one, right? Like a, a really nice looking one. It's prime arcane, four quid. Let's go there. Let's go there. No, 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 no. Okay, right, let's go sports direct. Ten quid. No, 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 no. no. Go, go to JD Sports, JD fucking expensive sports, JD. Take out a fucking mortgage, sports. So into JD fucking sports. Twenty-four pounds. I nearly spat my teeth out. So I'm. What, 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 what the fuck are we doing here? Twenty-four pound on a hat. What? Woo woo. I hope it can sing and dance. So yeah. But our tier has a lot of stuff. She's got a huge TV. She's got laptops, phones, Xbox ones. Um, all the general stuff that teenagers, uh, 17 year olds have. What did she want? Uh, and she's also getting like uh, two grand as well for 18. So she didn't need much really. But she was on about buying herself a, a PS4 because she wanted to play some games on there that she hadn't played before. So she has a PS4, offers for her birthday, save her buying itself. She has trainers, she has rucksacks, she has a 24 pound bloody hat, she has perfume, she has sweets. She has candles, she has lip glosses, she has bloody friends stationery because she loves friends. 
Cheers, everything. And then she's also got a thousand pound holiday, by the way, guys, because we go tomorrow to Wales. The cottage just costs us like 600 quid, along with travel and spending money. It's about a thousand pound. And then we're throwing her a big party, which fell through, unfortunately. That was meant to be next Friday. Fell through due to, not excited, sorry, due to COVID, obviously. So I'd say she's been spoiled. But the minute I'm just wrapping up, it's Sunday evening. Aim's chilling, finishing off packing. I'm wrapping. The dogs are snoring and sleeping. You have a look over there, the dog is. Yeah, the grey one back there, hiding over there. She's doing a lot better now. The DRS there. Hello, girls. Drawing me see, she's hiding in the middle. <laughs> yeah, so we're all good here, guys. I'm getting ready to rock and roll. And we'll be vlog, vlog, vlogging from tomorrow. Rolling on through for the week. Ladies, guys. Keep it rolling. Wait.